In this video, we will demonstrate how to remove a Falcon Y lock and replace it with a Falcon W Series Small Rose Lock. We will be removing a Falcon Y lock installed on a hollow metal door and replacing it with a Falcon W. These are the tools you will need. Using the pin wrench from the W box, remove the inside lever. Insert the screwdriver into the notch of the inside rows and gently pry it off. Loosen the two mounting screws from the inside spring cage. And while holding the chassis, remove the screws and slide the chassis and lever out of the door. Remove the two screws holding the latch to the door and remove the latch. In the box you'll find the chassis and outside lever, inside lever, latch, anti-rotation plate, rose, strike, fasteners, pin wrench, template, and instruction sheet. The Falcon W lock comes with all screws you will need for the installation. It is not necessary to reuse any Falcon Y fasteners. Actual size drawings of all fasteners are in the instruction sheet. Smooth any rough edges so the chassis will sit flush to the door, making sure not to enlarge the hole as the roses are the same size. For doors with a latch bore smaller than one inch, remove the metal sleeve from the latch. Secure the latch using the two smaller self-tapping screws. Ensure the bevel of the latch is appropriate for the swing of the door. Remove the outside lever and spring cage from the chassis. The Falcon W chassis must be adjusted to match your door thickness. To adjust the chassis, first turn the adjustment plate clockwise until it stops. Rotate the adjustment plate counterclockwise three full rotations for doors 1 and 3 eighths inches thick, and 9 full rotations for 1 and 3 quarter. The chassis comes set for 1 and 3 quarter. Reinstall the outside lever, rows, and spring cage. If you have a cylinder, install it at this time. Steps may be found in the installation instructions. Install the outside chassis assembly. Ensure the latch tail engages the slides in the chassis. If the latch is either too long or too short, contact customer care. Install the anti-rotation plate as shown. and secure with the two screws. Separate the inside rows from the spring cage. Slide the spring cage over the chassis, aligning the tab with the elongated notch. Secure with the two screws. To install the inside rows, align the groove on the top of the spring cage with the dimple on the rows. Rotate clockwise to tighten. Install the inside lever over the spindle until you hear a click. Remove the white protective cover from the strike and install the strike using the two screws. If you would prefer to use the smaller Falcon Y strike, you may do so. Test the lock function by rotating the lever to ensure the latch fully retracts and that the door latches when closed. For assistance, contact Customer Care at 877-671-7011.